Hey everybody, welcome back. It's day number six, and we are going to focus on for today. Woo -woo. All right, so you're going to grab a mat and two dumbbells, preferably something on the lighter side. Um, doesn't have to be as light as me. You can go heavier, but something that's functional for your abs. All right, you guys, and let's get into it. So, putting on the timer first, and we're going to start with our first set. Here we go. Okay, focusing on the obliques first. These guys on the sides, we're gonna grab both dumbbells, okay? I'm using two fives, a total of 10 pounds. Okay, you can go heavier or lighter if you don't have any weights, that's fine. You can totally do this without any, which is always great. All right, let's get into it. So, side plank. This time we're doing it on the hands. You're gonna place that hand down. All right, it doesn't matter what side. You're going to put one foot in front. So you're here, you're going to drop the hips and lift them up. And exhale, perfect. We're going to do that for 30 seconds, holding our dumbbell up in the air, okay? Let's go in three, getting into the position on the hand, two, and one. Nice work. It's a little bit different doing it on the hand, a little bit less stability than the forearm. That's okay. We're also getting more into that oblique. There's more range of motion for us to work with. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Let's switch sides. That was great, guys. All right. Same thing here. Let's go in three, in two, and one. Drop the hips. Perfect. Keeping those hips forward, bellies are tucked into the spine. Nice work. And five, four, three, two, one. Bring it down slow. Nice job. Release. All right. Next one. We're going into a side line oblique crunch. Don't need to wait for this. You're going to lie down on the side here. Okay, my knees are pointing forwards. Hips are pointing forwards. Now I'm going to rotate my upper body towards the ceiling, okay? So I'm feeling the mid to one side of my shoulder on the mat here. It's not the whole thing. Obviously the back one here is lifted. You can keep it. Hands are going behind your ears here. You're gonna breathe out as you crunch into that side of the week, okay? It's an oblique crunch. And we're gonna do it for 30 seconds. Let's go in three. And two, and one. Here we go. Breathing out. Two. Nice job. Fifteen more seconds. Keep breathing out. And five. Four, three, two, one. Beautiful. That was great. Let's flip it over to the other side. So same thing here. We're going to rest those knees on top of each other. Lie down and start in three, two, one. Here we go. Nice job. Keep going higher. Ten more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Release. Perfect. All right, next one here. So we're going into a hip rotation, okay, to a glute lift. We're going to do this on the hands too, okay? So regular plank. It's a little bit heavier for your 
obliques to sustain. You're here, shoulders are over the hands, you're going one glute, or sorry, one hip rotation. So I just went to the left hip, and I'm going to lift that left glute up. One more time. Hip rotation to the right, right glute. Okay? So make sure you lift the leg that that hip is rotating to. Okay? Same side, same line. In three, two, one. Here you go. And rotate. Lift. Other side. Lift. Perfect. Nice job. Ten more seconds. Keep going. Five, four, three, two, one. And drop to the knees. Nice job, folks. Okay, give the shoulders a little shake. We're going to start from the beginning. All right. Let's do it. So, grabbing your single weight. And we're going to go into our hip raises on the hand. Let's do it. And three, two, one. Here we go. Perfect. Always keeping those hips forward as much as you can. Woo, 10 more seconds, keep going. Three, two, one, and drop. Woo. All right, other side. And three, and two, and one. Here we go. Nice job. Spine is nice and long. That chest is wide. Your back should be up that tummy. Make sure that top arm is in the back behind that shoulder. It's spreading wide. Almost through. Five, four, three, two, one. Slowly bring it down. Nice job. All right. Going into our side plane, oblique crunch. Let's do it up. Alrighty. Knees are stacked. You're gonna try and keep the shoulders off the whole time, okay? Three, two, and one. Good work, keep those elbows wide. 15. Five, four, three, two, one. Excellent. Woo! Switching it around to the other side. Here we go. In three, two, one. Exhale. Keeping those elbows wide. That's gonna really help to work your core more than your actual neck, okay? Because your head is locked in to the hands. Keep those elbows wide. Woo, 10 more seconds. Three, two, one. Nice job, guys. All right, flip it over. Let's go to our high plank on the hands. We're doing our low, um, our hip rotation to the glute lift. Let's do it in three, two, one. Get that leg up high as you possibly can, folks. Nice work, that's it. Good. 
15. And five, four, three, two, one. Drop the knees. Nice job, guys. All right, moving on to our next phase. Uh, set. Phase one. We're gonna start with an overhead raise to a crunch, so a full crunch. Okay, we're gonna go down to our back and grab both weights this time. Okay, so second set. All about doing everything from our abs and lying down on our back, okay? So, really gonna push you guys to challenge yourself throughout these next five exercises because it is all on the back and we're gonna be staying in that position pretty much the whole time, okay? So, it's hard, get ready, you're fine, you will do it though. Alright, if anything ever wants to. First one, so knees are hip width apart, toes are pointing forward. And you're seated up first. Okay, from here, we're gonna extend those arms like so or like so. Let's do it this way, actually. So you're sitting on top like this. You're gonna roll down to an overhead raise. Your head does land on the floor, and then you're gonna push yourself back up. So upper body crunch, lying down, overhead raise here, takes you back up. Okay, we're gonna do that 30 times in three, 30 reps, two. And one, perfect, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine. Perfect. Ten. Keep going. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Good work. Fifteen. 16, try and keep that back on the floor. 17, especially when you do your overhead raise. 18, 19, 20, nice start, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 29, and 30. Fabulous, drop those arms, good work. Did you get to 30? I hope you did, okay. If not, you can go to 20, okay? I'm gonna try and add more each time, okay? All right, next one. So we got a side abductor to a hold, upper body hold, 30 times, okay? So you're gonna keep your weights right above your chest, you keep them here or here. You lift the shoulders up from here, you extend the legs, going out and in. Okay, shoulders stay up, legs are low, okay, think 45 or lower if you can, all right, so that's going to target the whole abdomen, especially that low pudgy area, okay, so let's do it, three, and two, one, let's go, 30 times, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Woo! Perfect. That was a nice fast one. 
All right, next one. We're gonna do a side to side leg raise, okay? So you're gonna um, keep your weights here with you, and I'll show you how it happens first. Keep your weights with you, you're gonna roll down. Okay, same idea. You're gonna put the weights together, and you're gonna lift the shoulders. All right, turn so your legs one side to the other. I'm counterbalancing with my weights, okay? Like so, so I'll show you here really quickly. I'm counterbalancing one here, other side. I'm trying never to lift my low back that stays on the floor, okay? You want to think of yourself as a little, little like a fish tail from your um, belly button down, okay? That part is moving all together, and your upper body is counterbalancing that side to side movement. Let's go. In three, and two, and one, 30 times. One, two, Keep 
your arms straight, hovering above the chest as you drive both knees in and out. That looks like this. In and out. All right. So I know we're probably feeling those abs now. That's okay. We're going to fight through it. This is our last one in terms of our laying down series, okay? We got this. Three, two, lift up the shoulders, tap the knees. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Ten more guys, we got this. Keep going. Nine or nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We're rolling up. Woo! Nice work. Okay, drop those weights. That was great. Our next one. We're going to play on the hands of Jen. So I got our last series here. Okay, we're going to kill it. Let's do it. In three, we're going to do a plank side hop. So I'll show you facing this way. Okay, so I'm starting with my hands underneath my shoulders, slightly wider. My toes, I'm going to plank here. From here, I'm going to jump to the side, back to center, to the other side, back to center. Trying to drive my knees down to the floor each time, okay? All right, let's go. Three, and two, and one. 30 seconds. Side to side hops. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice job. Land those knees. Next one, we're going to do a side knee drive. Okay? Still on the hands, you're going to do one leg at a time. Okay? So we're going to do one side for 30 seconds, and then we're going to take a little pause. We're going to stick to that same side, do a pulse, and then we'll go back, switch sides, do that side knee drive, go back to pulse. Okay? So stick with it. I'll keep you, keep you guiding through it. Okay, here we go. So, starting with right leg first, going to right knee drive. Okay, 30 seconds. Three, two, one, here we go. Driving that knee into the chest. Pulling belly in. Nice, we're almost through. Five, four, three, two, one. Excellent. Keep that right leg underneath. We're going to pulse it into our chest for 30 seconds. Okay, three, and two, and one. Let's go, lift, pulse. Right into the chest. Perfect. Keep going. 15. Five. Four. Three, two, one. Woo! Okay, nice job, guys. Let's do the other legs. Now on my left side, completely. We're going to switch, go back to just the single side knee dress, going up and down. Okay, forward and back. Three, two, one. Keeping those shoulders lifted. You can into that upper back. Here is never sinking. Always want to push it upwards as much as you can. Up to the ceiling. 
Ten seconds left. Five, four, three, two, one. Perfect job. All right, next one, we're gonna pulse that knee. In three, two, one, here we go. Nice work. Almost there. We got 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Release. Woo! Nice work. Give those shoulders a shake. Good job. Next one, we're going to a plank jack to a knee drive. So, takes a little bit of explaining, but you will get it. It's fire. This one is fire. So, you're going to start with your legs wide. Okay? Now, typically, jacks go like in and out, in and out, right? The only difference here, um, I'm going to show you this way so you can actually see what my legs are doing. So you're going out first, on the way in, you're going to lift one leg into the chest, okay? Out, in, out, in, okay? Keep switching the legs each time on that hop inward, okay? When you hop out, you extend both legs. In five, four, alternating the knees, three, two, and one, open, close, open, in with the other leg, open, knee drive, open, other side, keep going. That toe never touches the floor.